Our top stories tonight, Home Secretary Colonel Thomas Russell has warned that he's not afraid to come down hard on those who continue to illegally gather in anti-government marches. The family of opposition leader Daniel Strangford has urged anyone with information on his whereabouts to come forward. Strangford was last seen addressing rioters gathered at Trafalgar Square. The Dry Cleaners Union has entered its fifth week of industrial action. Laundrette tight. What the fuck is your problem, question mark? What the fuck do you think my fucking problem is, question mark? All I know is you've come up to me out of nowhere and now, dash. Fuck you, exclamation mark. You've done it now, you... Cunt. 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 Uh. Sorry. Hi. Can I help? James. Uh. Yeah. I need you to cover the evening program. Look. Is that live? What? Well, it's on now. Yeah. Yes, please. Firstly, comma, can, can you, you just put to bed the rumours that uh, the government had anything to do with the disappearance of Daniel Strangford? Well, I would like to send my deep sympathy to Mr. Strangford's family. But the sad fact of the matter is these things Sorry. happen. People go missing. Take a seat, Jeff. What is your game here? Are you a socialist or something? Tim. I don't know. Um, should I be? What? Tim, this isn't helping. Oh, forgive me. We discussed this. Look at him. He's not fucking Che Guevara. I'm sorry. Uh, what's this about? Well, maybe this will jog your memory. I'm pressing. Oh. Fuck. Yes, fuck. So now, thank you, Sarah. So now we have the fucking home office breathing down our necks. Deep breaths. <sighs> Whilst the, the trots could come smashing through the door any second. This is a critical time, John. It's good versus evil. We can't be seen to be too strongly one way or the other. I never other. meant to um, make it seem like you could criticise the government. Look. Look, Jim, I don't care what you believe. I don't like the man either. But the chart is coming up. These people don't like looking weak. It could be more than just our jobs on the line. The Colonel's coming in for a follow-up. We're giving you the opportunity to make amends. On air. You mean? 
on the TV. Yes. Congratulations, Jack. It's time for your 15 minutes. Haven't you got anything else? Uh, the dry cleaners weren't open. Sarah, can you do something? Yes. I'll get him something modest, but eye-catching. Mr. Kubin, it's fair to say that your actions have caused quite a bit of controversy. It could be argued that the word which you claim erroneously appeared was somewhat misogynistic. I will thank you tomorrow. I can shut. I'd never call a woman a, um, the C word. But you'd call Colonel Russell one, not Mr. Kubin. Mr. Kubin. Daisy Cotton. Mr. Kubin. He wants action. He no, will no, no, see no, no, action. He will go missing in action. There's the fucker. Disgraced subtitler Jerry uh, Joseph Kubin is currently on the run from the authorities. Kuban is believed to have made his way to the children's section of BTV Television Center. We now go live to a conversation between our very own Tim Barrett and Colonel Thomas Russell. Tim? Never done a decent day you work in their listen lives. to me, Captain Colonel, take, Colonel Russell. Take, take, it, it wasn't... It wasn't us. It wasn't us. It was the actions yeah, of one yeah, very, just... very, 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 <sighs> very strange, gangly, gangly oh, man. Hey, hey, you have to calm Don't down. Don't fucking tell me to calm down. I'm so sorry, full stop. I never meant to do anything wrong, full stop. I have been a complete idiot, exclamation mark. Right. I am going to teach you a lesson that you will take to your bloody grave. <laughs> 